energy. It's the backbone of modern society and the underpinning of our economy. All of us rely on this basic resource to keep our communities safe and businesses thriving. Clean, renewable electricity produced at federal dams plays a critical role in meeting everyday energy needs. These dams, owned by the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers, Bureau of Reclamation, International Boundary and Water Commission, and Tennessee Valley Authority, serve many other important roles and even offer life-saving services. These agencies, along with the Department of Energy's Power Marketing Administrations, bring the power of water to your front door through a network of electric superhighways, which make up the largest machine in the world, America's electric grid. Federal hydropower is critical to national security, providing a direct power source to many of the military bases and national labs. It may also be used to restore the grid during extreme weather events and other situations that have the potential to leave millions of people in the dark. This type of restoration is known as Black Start. Hydropower is one of the few sources of energy that can perform a Black Start, quickly bringing power generation back online and reducing impacts to the nation's bulk electric system. No other source of energy provides grid stability at such a low cost. This combination alone makes hydropower America's ultimate power generation resource. Hydropower is one of the largest generators of clean, renewable electricity. The Federal Hydropower Fleet has a generating capacity of 42 gigawatts, the same amount as 131 million solar panels or 17,000 wind turbines. Hydropower is a major job creator in the U.S. Federal dams generate nearly half of the nation's hydropower and fuel the economies of 33 states. Part of what makes hydropower unique is its flexibility. Unlike any other power resource, hydropower generation can ramp up or down to meet real-time energy needs and provide grid-stabilizing services. It is the perfect partner to wind and solar power. And as we meet the threat of climate change, hydropower contributes to a resilient, carbon pollution-free electricity sector by 2035, all while maintaining the electric reliability our lives and economies depend on. On average, federal hydropower prevents emissions of about 94 million metric tons of carbon pollution in the U.S. each year. The same amount is removing 21 million gasoline-powered passenger cars from America's roads. Federal hydropower is not-for-profit and contributes to grid stability through cost-based rates. These user rates are used to maintain and operate the dams and pay back the original federal investment plus interest. Construction of federal dams built American industries and brought power to rural and underserved communities, providing growth and opportunity. Although dams provide many benefits, they have also had an impact on surrounding ecosystems and tribal communities. To lessen the burden that dams have on nature, water quality, and tribes, programs were formed to balance those competing interests. It's important to continue the dialogue, to balance interests and impacts while preserving the hydropower capability and its value in a clean energy market. Hydropower is the bedrock of clean energy ready to serve, ready to keep our nation safe and thriving, and ready to meet the challenges of today and tomorrow.